But Measure for Measure is, uh, is my, my personal good luck play. It was the first play, first Shakespeare play that I was invited to do. It was by Joe Papp in Central Park. And it was a very successful, controversial, but very successful production, which actually started me on a career as a director of classical theater, something that I really hadn't set out to do at that time. I was an avant-garde director. I was doing new American plays. But I had a very strong ideas about this play and, uh, and did it. And it became successful. We won a lot of awards, all of us in it. And then I was invited to become a director at Stratford, Connecticut. And here I am. Um, I opened my first season at Stratford with Measure for Measure because it was, in a sense, a talisman for myself. And I've done it here with uh, Kelly McGillis and Philip Goodwin. I've changed my mind about Measure for Measure, by the way. When I first did it, it was because I thought it was a black comedy, that uh, Angelo was a kind of Tartuffian figure. But the whole thing was uh, a kind of biting satire on extremism and uh, and I thought it was blackly funny. And I did a production that was. Um, by the time I got to Washington, I had realized that Shakespeare was more complicated than sometimes some of my uh, conceptions of him, and that he was really writing, at least for me at the time, about the difficulties, one, of having to deal with a really corrupt, licentious society that had gone too far, and two, what the dangers of extremism were. What, what is a measure? What is the measure of how to have rule of law and humanity? I, I think it's a play that speaks to us now as strongly as any play of Shakespeare's.